Two emergency service workers are charged with first-degree murder after a man died following transport to a hospital. The Sagamon County State's Attorney's Office in Illinois says Peter Cadigan and Peggy Finley responded to the home of Earl Moore Jr. on December 18th at the request of Springfield Police. There we go. After review of investigative materials, I've classified Mr. Moore's death as a homicide. Stand up. Use your legs. Police say when they arrived, they were told Moore was suffering from alcohol withdrawal symptoms. Body cam video shows first responders inside his bedroom trying to get him to his feet, but he seems unable to walk on his own. One of the paramedics is in the room, but police say she offered no assistance to the patient, and the officers took turns carrying him out of the house. Once outside, the patient needed help getting onto the stretcher. After police helped get him on the stretcher, the other paramedic adjusted his position. Then both paramedics secured Moore to the stretcher and took him to the ambulance. He later died at the hospital. Dr. Denton has listed the cause of death as compressional and positional asphyxia due to prone face down restraint on a paramedic transportation cot stretcher by tightened straps across the back. Bail was set for Cadigan and Finley at $1 million. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Mara Montalbano.